Okay, I'm going to do a quick tutorial on the home page with uh, Pinnacle Premium. Right now, um, I basically just have the, the setup that kind of happens by default when you install. Um, and uh, if you're in the dashboard of the admin, the one of the one of the first big things to understand is that you can control your home page from the home layout section of the theme options. And from here, right now, all that's enabled is latest posts. Uh, and I can actually adjust how that style is right down if I scroll down to home blog settings. I can change the title. I can change how many posts. So let's say I want six. Um, I can choose the columns. And I can limit that to a category. So if I save that on six on the front end, I now have six blog posts. Um, the other thing too is if I enable page content, I have latest posts and page content save. I'm now going to show two sections of posts. That's the top. And then under that, I have my page content. And that's because right now, page content is set to be the latest post page. So if you go into reading of your WordPress settings, you'll see the front page displays. Right now, it's on latest posts. I'm going to change that to an empty home. And this empty home just has one line of text. So once I save that, and refresh the home page. I can see that I have just one line of text right there. Um, so going back into my theme options, I'm going to go back to home layout. I can change, I can remove latest blog posts and create the whole home page just using the page content. So now I'm going to go to that page empty home and there's my just one line of text. I'm going to remove that and click on page builder and use the example home pre-built page layout. That'll install an example um, of what you can do with page builder if I update that. Now I have a unique page builder layout. And you can edit from there or go back to your theme options. And let's say I wanted to add a portfolio carousel below all that stuff I added with the page content. So I just grab portfolio carousel, put it in enabled, I go down to the home portfolio carousel settings. I can set the title, I can choose a certain type. How many columns? I'm going to say four, default layout, and actually I'm going to do flat with no margin. Eight, and I'm going to turn on the full width layout and save changes. And now, at the bottom of my page, I have a portfolio carousel.